Hey, what's going on guys? And I'm going to be showing you guys how to install CCAPI 2.70 for your custom firmware PS3. So basically, uh, the download will be in the description where to get it from. But just in case, I just want to show you guys which one to actually get. If you Once you get on the website, you'll be up here, right? And Stone, coolest guy ever. You'll go down, go down, go down, go down. And this is how I learned, to be honest. I want, If you look up at the top, it says Rev70 added 4.80 DEX. So basically, you just want to scroll down. No, 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 no. Found it. Nope, sorry. You want to install this one. This Rev4 package. Not the developer. Trust me, you're not a developer. I mean, I might be, but you know, it's just because I'm me. I'm kidding. But basically, you just want to download it. Here's the file right here. I mean, I think that's the developer one. So basically, I have it open. And what you want to do is you want to... Do the PC setup, which is just follow, follow the settings along, right? Just follow it along, install it, and then it'll, you'll, it'll leave a, a desktop thing, of course, right? So then you just want to open it, right? Of course. And then, like anybody, including myself, just look around for a second, you know, get your idea of what it actually is. I mean, hey. And then what you would want to do is just nothing, to be honest. Like... You really can't do anything right now since it isn't set up on both your PS3 or whatever But I wanted you guys to open it just on the fact just to get you know look at it Look what it does. You know what I mean? Look what you can do and it has honestly so much more that we'll get into with like RTM tools and stuff But yeah guys just close that out right now and then open up Open up your 2.70 uh, RAR file again, and then just go back go to PS3 and you see there's a package file in there. I put it in there, I believe, already. Which one is it? Okay, there it is. Okay. I have found it. I already put it in. Just drag and drop. You know what we do with package files, guys. So, if you want, you could safely eject. I'm just going to unplug it because, honestly, guys, like, the only thing I would safely inject, I mean, is, like, is, like, um, the... The like custom firmwares and stuff like that's big. You know what I mean? Like this stuff. Like if it fails, I mean, it's not like it's gonna make or break you. Just delete it off your PS3, redo it, and this time actually safety safely e eject it. I mean, of course. Hold on while I put my USB stick in. Oh, one second. I'm gonna start my PV up, PVR up before we get on there. This way I could, you know, sync it better. I'm trying to get better at syncing it guys. I apologize for it being pretty eh. Like I've been trying to get better and better at doing, you know, with the microphone and like just a whole bunch of stuff. So basically what you want to do is now is to get on your PS3, have your USB stick plugged in the right, the right slot, the slot that is closer to your disc tray. That is what we always try to get through your heads guys because I don't know what will happen. Like I said, your PS3 might blow up. We'll never find out. But basically what you want to do is I'm going to stop the recording on my computer and start the recording on here. So basically what you want to do is is just wow. Look at that. 4.8. No, I'm kidding. But basically you want to do like what you always do guys with package files, go to package manager, go to install package files, go to standard and stone and just click X. It will install boom what do we got here now basically what you want to do is, is just click X on it boom 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 just click X it's just installing everything to your PS3 and then it will reboot very easy guys but a lot of the I wanted you guys to install this now because I'm going to get into RTM tools and how they work mostly and you know with Team Appy and stuff, we'll probably that Team Appy is probably going to be like episodes and episodes because personally, I'm not a big fan of it with the whole wired with like being connected to your computer and like yeah, it's it's a big process if you uh yeah. But basically, now you have CCAP installed. You don't need to open it basically anymore. To be honest, I opened it once on my jailbreak, on my on my jailbreak of course, and like I never touched it again. <laughs> but yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. Just honestly, don't try to mess with the file on your computer. I know it's kind of cool. Try to look around it, you know what I mean? And I'll explain it more in depth as soon as I can. Probably when I switch mine over, of course, which will be very soon. 
I'm just trying to get out of all these videos out today, but it's kind of difficult because my computer is running slow because I'm trying to get all these tutorials done. But I hope you all fucking enjoyed. I'm trying to bust my ass getting all of these videos out because the faster I get these videos out, the faster you guys get them and the faster you guys will learn, and then it will be awesome. But yeah, hope you all have an amazing day. Peace out, homies.